Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get mods in Gorilla Tag. But before we start, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, that It really helps out and um, turn the notification bell on. So if I post more modding videos or something like that, like or updated modded tutorials, you'll be the first ones to hear about it from this channel right here. Uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, real quick, I need to make a couple things clear. This tutorial is for modding Steam VR Gorilla Tag. You do have to buy it for $20, and this tutorial is not for modding an Oculus Quest or the Oculus app. I have, if you need a tutorial for modding the Oculus app on PC, I have another video for that. Uh, it, you can go look through my channel and find that. But you cannot mod Quest without a PC, and I don't mean like like a laptop or something or like a chromebook like you need an actual pc that's capable of running vr games okay now that i've got that out of the way let's get into the video the first thing we need to do is join my discord server so if you go to the discord here um click the little compass and then click explore communities and type in arbuck uh arbuck treehouse should be the first one that pops up if it's not scroll down until you see it you click that uh, just click, uh, I'll just look around for now or whatever. Uh, you, you go up here and click join Arbuck's treehouse. And it'll take you to this page. Uh, you can click whatever you want. Mod Gorilla Tag is probably what you want to do since you're actually modding Gorilla Tag. Um, you can select if you want custom maps, hats, materials, or, uh, just mods. Or whatever, uh, you select this. Uh, you do all that and then you have to go down here where you would type click Complete scroll down read the rules click this check mark click submit and then you can go over here in the channels and find PCVR modding click that uh, scroll up um, So download these five files um, this one or this one will be uh, different by the time this video is uploaded it will be the it'll be the Shiba Z menu um, because this menu is highly bannable and this one is not so it will be Shiba Z menu is what is what I will be using in this video so just imagine right now this says Shiba Z so first you're gonna go ahead and open WinRAR uh, download that and install all that you can uh, install WinRAR uh, just click OK, click Done. Then this will pop up. Just just close that. You don't need that. Um, then you can open these two later. After that, go to go ahead and go to Steam. Go to Gorilla Tag. Uh, go to Settings. For, uh, where is it? Uh, uninstall. Just to make sure that you don't have anything on it that like if you had a, tried to mod if, mod it earlier or something that you don't have anything messed up it's just a clean slate uh just to completely redo it so nothing's uh messed up okay after that okay then go to monkey mod manager make sure bepinex is clicked um scroll down find computer interface utila ptm loader and i think think yeah and that should be it so after that click install slash update and then go to utilities go to game folder and then go to bepinex and then go to plugins so you you should have these five things in here also if you are in monkey mod manager do not click any mods you want that's not how it works like there in there a lot of these don't work and will just crash your game and then your game won't work so please do not just click whichever mods you want and then think it's fine it's it's not so after that you can go ahead and drag the mod menu it doesn't even have to be shiva's you, if you're in my discord you can also go to good mods and, and find some other menus in there like iclown here or you could have uh, the original 5.5, uh, the one that's really bannable. I would not suggest using this for them. Or you can go to other discords and find other mods. So you can go ahead and open after the after you put your mod menu of your choice um, in here. You can go to Unity, open that, 
um, close this again. Uh, go to open this, double click that, and then highlight these two, and then bring your folder kind of over here. Highlight these two, and then just drag them over. And then close this and then then go out of plugins go back to gorilla tag up here go to gorilla tag data go to managed and then open this managed and then then double click this and then highlight all of these or you can just do control a and then again just drag these over and then it will say replace files in the destination so just click that and then you're good to go it's it's that easy if you want some other mods like punch mod or something like that you can also go in my discord and there's other mods in here like the big small mod uh, custom map loader, uh, who is talking mod, punch mod, uh, gorilla cosmetics, so all that stuff like that. So if you ever, if you did everything correctly, you should have this uh, black bar up here somewhere. Uh, that is Unity Explorer. Um, I might make a video on that separately. Um, but also, you should have a mod menu. Um, I accidentally pulled that out of the folder, so I don't have it on my hand. But you should, just by clicking the thumb on your left hand, uh, there's two thumb buttons, click the bottom one, uh, I think it's X on the Oculus controller. So click uh, X, hold it down, and then there's all that. Um, I also made a video on this menu, so you can go find that. It's called Gorilla Tag's Best Mod Menu, with a bunch of question marks and exclamations at the end. So I hope this video helped. If you liked it, please subscribe, it helps me out, because since I helped you out, you can help me out perfect uh like the video and yeah see you in the next video